Hi guys, I hope you're all well. It's currently Sunday the 19th of July 2020 and welcome to week 236 of my weight loss journey. We've all seen now for the past five weeks I've maintained my body weight at 163.2 kilograms which is 359.8 pounds or 25 stone 9.8 pounds and of course my body mass body mass index remained at 47.7. I'm going to start the proceedings off by reviewing my calorie consumption for the past week which we can see in the graph above. The average of this was 2,458 compared to the previous week at 2,451. It's increased by 7. Nothing much to worry about. It's within my 2,500 calorie allowance which is obviously great and where I'm wanting to be. I did change my menu up for a second consecutive week, this time chicken based. I made a massive batch of a chicken vegetable chili, um, fried off the chicken and then whacked it into a massive pot and then just added loads of tin vegetables, obviously top, chopped tomatoes, um, different varieties with herbs, garlic, uh, red kidney beans in a chili sauce, butter beans, sweet corn, peas, carrots, peppers, and for the last 20 minutes of it cooking, I threw in a massive bag of kale. And I must admit, it was very tasty. Um, I also made another quiche with cottage cheese. Last week I made it with 500 grams of cottage cheese and about eight or 10 eggs. This week, I've put 300 grams of cottage cheese in and about 12 eggs and it was a vegetable quiche, peas, peppers, carrots, herbs and I must admit it turned out nice as well. So I've really enjoyed the food this past week and uh, I'm hoping for good things. Activity wise, my step count for the past week can be seen in the graph above. The average of this was 10,313 compared to the previous week at 10,858. It has decreased, but uh, it's still above my 10,000 step mark average, which I'm over overall aiming for. Uh, I also fit in my activity in terms of my dumbbell exercises. I said I wanted to do this on Tuesday and Thursday, and I achieved that. So it's been a pretty perfect week. It's that time of the week where we all get to see if I've managed to lose any more weight. So here it is, guys. Here's my Wayne. I weigh 162.4 kilograms, which is 358 pounds or 25 stone, eight pounds. This means, yes, I've finally broken this maintain cycle by seeing a loss of 1.8 pound or 0.8 kilogram. So I'm very pleased with this result. Nearly a two pound loss. I'll happily take that after seeing five weeks of maintaining. Obviously my Slim World result is still going to be shown as a maintain though because those groups don't start back up until mid-August. Based on this loss though, my Christmas weight gain total loss is 93.7% complete. So I still require to lose another 1.8 pound and then that is it. It is a sayonara to that Christmas weight gain. Based on this week's weight loss, it sees my body mass index go from 47.7 down to 47.5. And if we look at my third weight loss target, last week it was 59.1% complete. And after the loss, it goes up to 61.7% complete. So in the 236 weeks that I've been doing this weight loss journey, I have lost a total of 183.2 pounds, which is 83.1 kilograms or 13 stone, 1.2 pound. Next week, I'm planning on reverting back to my tuna salads for my lunch and my chicken and vegetables for my evening meal. I was just uh, out of curiosity, I'm just, now that I've seen a loss, I'm wondering if I go back to my somewhat normal food choices, will I now see a continued weight loss? It's also to use up some of my bulk food that I had, because um, when I buy tuna, I buy a massive amount of tuna. Um, so that's one of the other reasons why I'm doing that change. In terms of my three 
stats, the only one that I'm focusing on is my fluid consumption. Obviously this week it's fell below 3,500 milliliters, so I want to get it back above that. Activity wise, I'm still going to be doing my walking, but as well, I'm wanting to still continue with the dumbbell exercises on Tuesday and Thursday. But other than that, guys, that's it. That's the end of this week's video. As always, if you'd like to continue following me along my weight loss journey and hopefully get to see much less of me in the future, by all means, subscribe to my channel so you don't get to miss out on any future videos that I post. I wish you all a fantastic week. Stay safe, look after one another, and I'll see you all again next Sunday.